All right, today, people, we at the candy shop. Long current equipment company, where I do most of my damage. And Webster Gross. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there it is. And I like coming here because they got some of everything. They deal in steel, echo, and everything else you can think of. Got a Bravely, X Mark, all your leaf stuff. And this is what I had my eyes on a 36 inch Pro Stance by Gravely. This is getting all those backyards that I can't get into. All of them. All right, this is the showroom, the aerators, the little robots, seats. Billy Goat Leaf Getters, all of this. Like I said, this one stop shop. They got it all. More, you got your gravy section. Everything. They also sell Toro in here. Oh. It's a grandstand. I wonder if it's a multi force. See the price on that bad boy. It's a demo. Yes, sir. These gravies, I've been I've been looking at them. I've been hearing good stuff about them. The commercial the commercial gray ones. Got your Dixie Chopper. Red Max blowers and stuff. Stuff everywhere, people. Sprayers, there's your trimmers, edges and all that by Red Max. Got your echo section. Still echo all the way to the wall. Good stuff. All your attachments. Yeah. I'm gonna need to come in here and get a couple of these. Pressure washers. Once again, we have St. Louis long curtain equipment. Echo backpack floor racks. Racks of them. Nice. And then for you steel lovers, they got this whole wall, all chainsaws. The X mark section we coming up on. Snow blowers. Steel backpack blowers. We got the steel mowers in. Not the big ones yet. They actually had the mowers in. Then of course the rest of your steel lineup. Attachment wall. <laughs> got the X mark section. Look like a few models been sold. X Mark Moors, commercial 30. Toro right there. Got the Laser Z. It's just, I think that's a 72. With the folding. How you doing? Got the Radius. Another Laser Z, 60. Look like a 6260s. And then that's the Vertex. Got it all, people. Your one-stop shop. And then here's the Electric Central. 
Now over the off season, I do plan on uh, investing in the uh, electric. Well, I'm gonna do Echo, but I'm gonna invest in the electric trimmer and the electric edger. <clears throat> just to uh, just to save a little bit on mixed fuel. Use them until the battery run out, then go with my gas. We do probably do two batteries for each. Not that bad. So I'm looking at 400 a unit from the looks of things. All right. I got to go to the service department myself and pick up pick up my uh. Yeah, I gotta go over here to service and pick up my uh, head trimmer. Okay, people, what lawnmower shop you know offer free popcorn, free drink, free coffee, and free ice cream? I would indulge, but wouldn't be no working going on with me today. Hey Tom, so that bar isn't broke. <clears throat> Cause I've, I've always, I've always thought it was, yeah, that section right there, right through here. Yeah, they said it's supposed to be like that. Well, there, this is a cap. That's a cap. And this piece would probably go to here. Okay. But so I, nothing I, major. Right. Right. All right. All right, I, I I brought it in the fish originally. I thought I had to replace this whole bar. I just thought it came across the whole I mean, top. We, we could. <clears throat> that, that's a, a cap. Okay. They said they didn't have one right now. I called earlier right. this week. Yeah, he said he didn't have one because I, he told me the price, and I said, "Well, did they fix the part?" And he said, "No, because yeah. uh, it's not." It looks like it did snap here, but it connects right <clears throat> there. So that that this is just a, an end cap. Okay. Because you would accidentally touch the. You know, it keeps it from tearing okay. up the ends. Yeah, I, I mean that's that's fine. If if it's from here to here, I'm not worried about yeah. it. Yeah, I just thought it was messing up the rigidity of the no, actual. You're good. Okay. All right, I'm ready. Time to take care of business. Okay, people. Like I said, it's my favorite place. They treat me right. They got it all. St. Louis Long Curtain Equipment. Yes. But yeah, I learned in this game, it's a, it's a must that we uh, support our... It's so... In St. Louis right now, so many Long Curtain uh, providers have went out of business. I bought all of my equipment. Excuse me about the lighting. I bought all of my equipment from uh, Millbrandt, uh, Long Cur. <clears throat> and uh, right after the uh, Corona, well, right during the coronavirus, they were one of the biggest. They went out of business, and uh, they pretty much they sold they sold the land and everything. So I wouldn't say they went out of business, but they sold their land. And I'll deal with that later. Yeah, I wouldn't say they went out of business, but they they sold their land, and it was a blow to some of everybody. So I try to support as much as I can. Like I will try and order from this, you know, from the uh, lawn care instead of ordering from these facilities instead of ordering online if I can. If they don't have what I'm looking for, of course I'm gonna go online. But just support your. Uh, your in-town places. I try to do it as much as possible. And they'll start taking care of you. You know, anywhere you spend money, you're gonna get taken care of after a while. Please know that. Um, like I said, once again, it's Elite Cuts Lawn Care. And I'm out.